Hey there everyone, this is Al Cow playing Vanilla Level Design Contest 10, also known as VLDCX. You say X out of 10 because it's rad. Lake Constance by Mario Fan Gamer. That's what we're gonna be playing now. Whoa, look at that! There's like little walls here. Oh, and it's all different. Oh, there's an invisible one up. Oh wait, so you're advertising the extra checkpoint? <laughs> Alright, maybe it's- no, there's no secret exit. Well, let's see what Lake Constance has to tell us. If you're gonna give me a yellow sw like, if you give me two switches, I might pick one. If you just give me one, I'll pick it, because yellow has a chance of giving mushrooms, and if you're just gonna corner off power-ups, I like power-ups. I like feeling powerful. It is something you get sometimes when you play the Mario. I mean, you can get a save here. It's pretty exciting. Let's go, Lake Constance. Constantly. Here we go. Starts off very smooth. There's a little. Oh, there's the second little guy. Oh, uh, there we go. There's the lake. All right, I got the coin. I got the plant. Well, I didn't get the plant, but I saw the plant. It's basically the same as getting it. I wanted to sit down on the land and heard the guy, but the opposite happened. That fish is swimming left and right. Whoa. Yeah, it was a little bit scary. I put myself in danger. I'm gonna go inside his pipe. I don't even know why. Look at all that. It's a no. It's a shape you can make using basic cereal. That's all you need to live. Hey, fish. So, like, any special prizes in any of these? I don't know. I'm doing things. I'm making decisions. I'm going in pipes. Here we go. I'm now somewhere. I don't know where. That guy's gonna dig a hole. Incredible. I gotta block that guy's gonna turn around. And that fish is very floppy. Here we go, floppy fish adventure in the yogurt zone. Alright, so, okay, so, you know what, see there, here's where the yellow switch palace paid off. Here, where's that guy's hopping? Whoa, no, he's gonna kick that shell. Incredible. Never thought I'd see that in a million trillion years. Alright, maybe this is not tide water, and it's just bottom of the level water. Which has different implications. See, I thought it'd be tide water, because you got those kind of, like, floppy fish everywhere. And I figured, you know, if you, if you, if you, if you don't go fast enough, the floppy fish won't be floppy anymore, and I'm gonna jump right in that fireball. But see, I don't need rising tide to jump right in the fireball. That's just the reality of it. You just like jump? That's way too high. Well, I don't know what's the mystery about then. There you go. You, you keep on, keep on, keep it on, my friend. Uh, Maybe that row of coins is where a moon was. I don't know. Ooh, we got text. Don't grant. Germany just says, I know. So that's really. Germany just says, I don't know. No, that's really case. It really should have been called Lake I don't know. Okay. So your level's name's supposed to be a pun that doesn't work in English? Lake Constance's area is shared by Germany, Austria, and Switzerland. Swiss want clear borders, the Austrians don't. So it's based on a real place? Am I getting a geography lesson to hear? Because that sure is one way to demarcate yourself. With the threat of a pop-up, uh, pop-up land, pop-up mushroom. I was sure that was, that meant that this was going to be like a long, grueling marathon with an extra midpoint, but no, it's just a nice little bonus. You know, don't let fear rule your mind. That's the lesson here. Thanks for that, Mario fan gamer. Dark Data Tower is a pretty amazing name, and let's see if it lives up to it. Level brought to us by Silver Swallow. Uh, there's a little bit of everything. There's a little bit of nothing. Dark Tower at the Yoshi Residence. Oh, geez. Oh, man. <laughs> look at that Cyber Roy going on there. I paused to look at his frames because it looks pretty good. Is that a door? That is a door. I heard this song in many hacks. This is a song that happens a lot. Oh, he loses his royness once he loses his shell. So, this is the part, this is one of those contests. Look at those buildings. 
Like, those just look like buildings in the SNES game. It does not look vanilla at all. This is pretty amazing. Oh, oh, that's a ninja. Don't be fooled. That's a paracoupa. I just don't got wings. There's a big door. But I can't go there. Got it. Okay. Got it. Okay, I don't know what's going on. That's fine. I thought I saw a, a shell fly off or something here. Did, did I see something wrong? It's possible. Is that a door I can go in? Is this- oh, whoops, well, okay, that's not a door I can go in. I mean, it's obviously meant to r remind you of a door, but it cannot do the actions of a door. So I guess I'm just- oh, this one I can enter, though, so maybe I just entered them bad. It's possible. Okay, so, oh, I- yeah, I- <laughs> I just kind of muddled there and let myself be hit, basically. No pride there. Okay, this, uh, does the level continue beyond there? It's kind of hard to tell. I like the logo. Alright, so yeah, I don't know if those doors that I didn't go in, if it's just that I wasn't placed well, or you just can't really tell which doors you can go in or not, which uh, would, would be kind, kind of a problem. Alright, let's explore a little bit, like this door here. That's, so that's a football, just bouncing around. Ridiculous. Yeah, I just- there's nothing I can do around that door to go it. So some you can go in, some you can't. You just have to live with that reality. This door- this is a door I can go in. Got myself- there's a round there. That's kind of scary. I shouldn't have done that. Like, oh, oh, okay, it's an indicator of laser orbs. Got it. I don't know if I'm supposed to glean what's going on on the other side or what. Or if I'm supposed to wait so I can get the money. No, this was a race to get the dragon coin. Got it. I'm now in X room. Lasers happening. That, I feel like that's gonna hurt or something. Maybe I need to find... A, oh, wow. That's clever there. Your ability to disguise yourself only matches your ability to mind yourself. So that's in the background. Okay, yeah. The bony beetle doesn't respond to shells. Because they've never been programmed to exist environment where both were going to be found. Yeah, so the red line is still red lining. What? Okay, so they do hurt you, by the way. I got that confirmed. Do I want to go here? Be sure, why not? Platform, here we go. Going the way of the astronaut. Maybe. Yeah, we're going to go behind that. There we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, bullets. They're just happening. There's a big old death door, they say hi. Shells live inside and will bop you on the side. Dang it! Things just keep- Ugh, that's solid. That guy's gonna- okay, he didn't pin me, like I thought he would. Well, I'm glad. <laughs> well, this is just silly. Who created this monstrosity? That would never sell. Even- what? Uh, okay! There's a midpoint here! <laughs> and a reset? I don't know. This animal was convert- oh, I'm in a different room. The Yoshi was converted to a shell? I'm confused. So, I will give that as a big criticism. Oh, yeah, now we're on the other side of this. It's kind of hard to tell sometimes what is solid- so that hurts randomly, got it. It's hard to tell sometimes what's solid, what isn't. Like, what's a wall? What is just a very strong foreground fake wall? Well, I got a one-up, so maybe we got a fake, fake, fake midpoint, which, fine, okay, I'm okay with that. I don't know where I am. So these are always non-solid. Don't know where I am. Ah, uh, do I wanna go up? I mean, I guess, uh, I can't. Can I not go up to that floor? No, I can't, so never mind. Uh, okay, this is solid, this is not high fireballs, like, I kind of let you hit me there. Is this solid? That is solid, alright. Got a wheel gator going on, which is always a good- I got- I'm not sure what I bought that was solid. Yeah, the more I play this, the more this feels like an issue to me. Alright, so did I get, like, an extra, like, that one-up pop-up? Was it- was it meaningful? I'm trying to enter a door that I don't understand. Yeah, I'm back here at the laser shaft. Okay. 
That's fair. I think. Mm-hmm. Laser balls bouncing up and down. But then I didn't get it, so I don't know. Well, I guess it brought me back to the laser wall, if anything. Alright, let's get confused. Like, I almost wish I had a fireball, if only for the ability to throw it at things to tell if they were solid or not. I feel like if that's one of your greatest wishes, something might have gone wrong. Uh, dude, relax. Okay, the fan doesn't hurt. I've played a lot of ROM hacks where the fan hurts, so... That was my assumption. Yeah... Like, it's very interesting, I was like, look at the textures on these, like, cyber walls, for example. It's really neat. There's a lot of really neat things. But it's a bit much in part, and the heart parse. Is this a robot mouth I can enter? Not this time. Also, that fact. Doors, some things that looks like doors you can go in, others you can't. Just heard a wizard sound? No, it was, uh, Charlie splitting. They share sound banks, alright? Go to the same place. Make checkouts. Alright, so that's Minji. That's still Roy. Cyber Roy. I got your shell. And now you're dead. Well, not yet. Whoa, football. Here we go. Football dreams. Uh, Alright, there's no wings. So. Well, that's awkward a little bit. That little cyber zone there. Cyber softball. Being softballing it up. I don't know where I'm going. Is it here that I'm going? I mean, there's fresh new enemies here, so probably. All right, you're hopping, you're happening. We got uh, voice modulations going all all across the background. All right, there's a solid wall. That that dotted blue line can't have more solid than that. Now we're in like cyber building, Cassiope. I think that's a city. If it's not, we'll make it. It's fine. Uh, I got blocks here. Yeah, I'm big! Here we go! A thousand points and money! And a spinny! That's the best reward! Alright, we're on the ceiling now. I've escaped with Yoshi, I guess. Is that what this means? Um... Okay. I don't know if I care much for this, but this is happening now. What's the safest way to my Yoshi grow. Like, I guess it would be to throw it at the top guy, like, yeah, I'm gonna get bop from underneath. That's fine. I don't like how I just got hit on the way here, in a clumsy way. Ah, this is scary! Like, you know? I'm already, like, a tiny- Whoa! Hooray! I did it! We're on the main map! <laughs> We're not on the main map. We're on the opposite. Like, just stop this, fireballs. Alright, no, uh, nope. Alright, now I can fly. Let's escape the dark tower data and get bot in a dumb way, right here. Alright, well this is like our pit stop. It's all good. I'm just flying blind here. Here we go. Oh, there's a door I can go into. Oh, there's a goal. Well, can you go in that door? Doesn't look like it. The bullet stop. Okay, I guess that's just how we exit. Post gold orb. <laughs> That was scary at the end. I was getting worried. I was extremely worried yet. I, I, there was a lot of discomfort, but yeah, the level is cool. It's just hard to tell things. Like it's, the aesthetic parts are really well done, but it can intrude on the gameplay, which is something you always have to be careful about. Man, uh, the file I got here is just called Yoshi's Island 1, so, alright, let's go by Hiraga. There are- uh, <laughs> Why does that still make me laugh? Like, I tend to get tired of jokes real quick, but that just still makes me laugh to this day. Alright, well... Yoshi's Island 1, the sky is purple and starts like Yoshi's Island 1, and things were kind of framey there. Blue is true. I will understand as much as I want to. Fish, blue is true. What do you mean by that, though? Like, there was a blue coin there. Is, is that what you mean? This is purple. Blue is true! 
without you! I know if you, because there's a pipe there, that's what you want to take. Level took a spin in Pipeland. Blue is true, you can go in. Oh, I see. So you gotta be careful, because oh, things are interesting around blue coins. It's a good thing that box told me. I never would have sussed that one out. Oh, a mushroom. Ah, wiggler. Ah, panic. Alright, blue is true, so there's gonna be, yeah, a spiny palooza surprise. And eventually, this will lead to a prize, which I believe is called Progress over there. Look at that, some of them are still rolling around. See, because otherwise you fall down here, and there's nothing happening. Like, that's just the way, it's the only way you can go, is this top route. And I got, I got fallen and got hurt in a sad way. Sadness knows no appeals. I think you're relatively safe on these. You can tell if the egg, like, had time to touch the ground or become frown. Those are meaningless words I'm spouting. It's pretty fun. Alright, Lakitu. Yeah, blue is true. I didn't expect you to do that, Lily Eye. You uh, moved around in a way I didn't see coming. Oh, there's a pea switch here. That's scary. Why would you need a pea switch? I don't know. That, well, probably for that. Blue is true, so maybe you want to go up there? Blue is true. Yeah? Looks like it. Alright, so you do that. No, I got myself my platform. I got myself my way. I can now play the xylophone and forget to pay. Alright. Beauty has been achieved. Hey, look at these Goombas. They're so happy to be here. Look at that. Look at that crazy thin style. Ah, oh, classic. Alright, check that out. I'm gonna bounce here. Then I'm gonna start to hold a button. Then I'm gonna fall. <laughs> All part of the plan. Let's try that again. But this time with more conviction. You will not convict me alive. Alright, so you do that. Then you bounce here. Like, you could go on the green land. But I think that's scary. There, it's like a big reverse pee. Yes, look at that spiny. It, like, it double backs. It's a trickster. Alright, so I guess I'm just gonna let it go forward. So it falls here. Now I can bounce on it and forget about the sun. I forget about the sun. I don't know what that means. I don't know how this place works. I guess that will do. And then you can fall across the moon. And then here it didn't work. I don't know, this looks kind of muddled. The, I feel like the very low camera there is kind of unfortunate, but you get to experience this by dying. Look at that. All these levels where I didn't die. Maybe I missed out on exciting weird formations like this. I don't know. Extra midpoint. Extra crispy. Oh yeah, that's probably that all. Flit. Uh... Yeah, this is gonna be... It's not ideal. Oh boy. Uh, especially not anymore. Yeah, I got played, I feel like. It's fine though. Cause there's another mushroom here, I think? I guess it's not here. But in a similar place. <laughs> Go. There we go, here we go, J just go. Go, just gonna let it do its thing. We want it to be a hen. Ah, yeah, there's the mushroom I was remembering. Pop, pop, pop. Maybe you're supposed to use the bomb on some of these? I don't know, like... I made, I made this work once. Now I expect it to work forever again, but like, yeah, is this gonna rise or is it just weird looking? Alright, oh, okay, I guess I got my answer. Uh, oh, oh, okay, oh shoot, uh, alright, I'm glad that I managed to get in there, it's always easy. Yeah, you see, look at that! This level looked kind of weird and was just pipes all over the place, but it did things in terms of gameplay. Like, there were some real awkward jumps in there. But, like, I mean awkward in the best way possible, if that's possible. <laughs> but no, yeah, kind of like that one. 
it was it was fun. Like this was genuine. There was like some fun setups. You did weird things, and it was an obvious theme with no blue is true, spiny and you. Yeah, yeah, I like this.